Hi, welcome. I'm Melinda Kopp, founder and executive editor of The Writer's Sherpa. If you are a coach, speaker, consultant, or a self-employed professional, and you are interested in writing and publishing to establish expertise, build a following of readers and potential clients, and grow your business, then I want to share with you an easy way to make writing a priority and not a pain. Okay, whether you're working on a book or an article marketing campaign or even a blog, writing is like exercise. And if you really want it to work for your business, then you need to make writing a priority, just like going to the gym or your yoga class. Okay, so let me guess what you're thinking. But I'm too busy. How do I squeeze writing into my already packed schedule without giving up all of my free time? Well, everyone worries about that, and I have a few suggestions for you. Because, you know, it's hard to find time to write, especially when you're running a business. So to make time, to write great marketing content, a priority in your business, without sacrificing everything else you do, then consider these tips. Number one is schedule small chunks of writing time. You don't need hours upon hours of writing time to be productive. And no matter your intentions, most people, especially when you're running a business, can't devote more than an hour to writing on any given day. So the key is to schedule small increments of time, maybe 30 minutes a day, on as many days as you can. And then make sure you show up for your writing appointments and focus on writing during the time that you do have. Okay, tip number two is maintain a list of writing ideas. So when you're working on a tight schedule, you need to make the most out of your time. So one of the best ways to do this is start a list of topics you want to cover in your marketing materials, articles, and reports. You can add to it whenever you want and wherever you are. So if you're, you know, riding on the bus or... Um, you know, working out at the gym and you think of an idea for an article, then you can just write it down. Um, you know, so then you can add to it whenever and wherever you are and then pull out the list when you're ready to write. So for example, I have a list of article ideas that I refer to all the time. I mean, every week I pull it out and look at it. And then maintaining a list of ideas to write about makes it easy to sit down and be productive every time. Tip number three is learn to improve your own writing and your writing and your editing skills. Okay, so the better your skills, the faster you'll be when you sit down to write. And the more you practice, the better your writing will be. So just like you'd invest in any other skill, spend time honing your skills by taking courses, reading about writing, and analyzing successful marketing materials that other people have written. Investing your energy in improving your skills will pay off with more effective copy. Tip number four is be systematic about writing your marketing materials. Okay, so implementing systems is an easy way to ensure good results. And I'm a huge fan of this strategy because once I figure out a system, then I don't have to think about it anymore. All I have to do is sit down and write. So for example, I know that every Tuesday and Thursday I write a marketing article. Every article is about the same length and they're typically structured in a tips format. So then I take that article and I systematically submit it to all of my favorite online directories. You know, I post on my blog and I go through this same system every week. So this process means that I don't have to think, you know, I don't have to sit down and think, well, what am I going to do to get the word out about my business today? You know, I have that article system in place and I use it consistently. And so I never have to reinvent the wheel. All right. Tip number five is repurpose your content. So once you've written an article or other piece, look for ways to refocus it or compile it with other materials to create something new. For example, you could combine a collection of articles into a special report or ebook or even a, a physical book if you wanted to. And you can refocus your past trade magazine articles to fit the needs of different groups of readers. So looking for ways to reuse your written content makes every minute you spend writing even more productive. Okay, now if you really want to make to establish expertise and grow your business by writing and publishing, then you need to make writing a priority. So schedule it into your day and set yourself up for success by maintaining a list of ideas, investing in your skills, and being systematic about the marketing materials that you write and publish. Use a process. And then to squeeze in even more results out of your writing time, make sure you repurpose your content by refocusing it for new audiences and combining it with other pieces to make something new. When you use these strategies for making writing a priority, you'll develop the writing habit in no time. Now, for more tips on writing and publishing to establish expertise, build a following of readers and clients, and make more money, sign up for the Write Path e-zine at www.writerssherpaprograms.com. 
And one more thing, if you sign up today, you'll get a free copy of my report, Write to Grow Richer, The Seven Secrets of Writing to Sell Your Services. And you'll get a free video, The Three Things You Can Write Today That Will Bring You Leads Tomorrow. So again, go to www.writersherpaprograms.com and sign up to get these free resources today. Thanks so much.